Simon several hours ago, the Nimax Online Studios revealed new daily login rewards in March. And this time, guys, they're going to be really awesome and you definitely do not want to miss them. So what's about daily login rewards in March? At first, from day 1 to day 6, you will get scale color crown crates to in total 10 crates. And it's not uh, static crown crates like you've got previous months, like, uh, for example, this month we've got 3 crown crates, regular crown crates and 1 crown crate uh, with static rewards, with 1 uh, pet and 2 uh, just regular rewards. This time it will be regular default crown crates with 4 or 5 rewards, where you can get even mounts like Epix, Radiant Mounts, etc. etc. So 10 crown crates from, from just logging in, in the game from day 1 to day 6. And next reward will be one of the best, if not the best DLC in the game, especially if we're talking about its usefulness in current meta, it's Arsenium DLC on just daily login day 2. So you definitely do not want to miss this reward, you will get one of the best DLCs in the game just for free. And we'll talk about this DLC a little bit later, after we uh, come through all the, all, all the rewards. Next reward on day 7 is Seals of Endeavors, and this time you will get 500 Seals of Endeavors. And why am I so excited, and why you should be excited, because one week from weekly challenges you get something like from 200 to 300 uh, Seals of Endeavors, and this time you will get uh, two weekly challenges rewards. It's 500 in total Seals of Endeavors, and it's really, really awesome and, and really great amount. Of, of these seals. And next reward will be Kraglorn Velva Pets on day 14 daily reward, just for free, just from daily login. And more of that, you will get mount, another free mount, Iron Orc Velva mount on just day 21 uh, day, day, uh, daily login. Yes, there are two rewards in Orcs in Orc thematic, but still there are wonderful rewards: Orc mount, uh, Iron Orc Velva mount, and this pet. And more of that, if it wasn't enough, Zos has decided to make another rewards for every player who is owning Arsenium. And from just playing main storyline, from just completing main storyline, from March 4th till the April the 1st. You will get additional rewards from Crown Cray, from Crown, Crown Store, and for just completing main storyline, you will unlock new rewards in Kfur Ursak Mounts. But be careful, guys, because you will need you you will need to claim to redeem this reward in Crown uh, Store from March the 4th till April the 1st. If you miss redeeming this reward, you will not you will not get it. So after you complete the main storyline, you will go. You will need to go to Crown Store and to redeem these rewards. And also, if you kill all the six world bosses in the Arsenium Zone, you will also unlock this awesome three, um, awesome three uh, costumes: Eternity Tunic uh, with Pants Brilliance, bro uh, Brocade Robes, and this Summit Lord Silken Robe costume. And it just for playing Arsenium DLCs, it will be free for all players uh, logging in on day 21. So if you want, if you want to get these rewards, you just need to complete main storyline for Mount and to uh, kill all six world bosses in Arsenium DLC in Arsenium Zone, and to click these rewards in Crown in Crown Store from March the 4th till April the 1st. And why Arsenium DLC is one of the best DLCs in the game, and especially, as I already said, if we are talking about uh, um, its usefulness and new players, it's definitely one of the best DLCs in the game, if not the best, because there are, there are, there are a bunch of really awesome sets in, in the zone, in this DLC, and one of them is Briarheart. And why Briarheart is one of the best sets in the game? Because if you are playing solo, if you are a solo player, or if you are farming such activities like, for example, Maelstrom Arena or um, newly added uh, Infinite Archive, um, you definitely need this set, especially if you don't want to play uh, such popular and community one bar builds with Orc and Soul Ring. Because what this set is doing from just dealing critical damage, this set increasing your weapon and spell damage for uh, 431, if I remember correctly, weapon damage and spell damage in, um, in purple 
quality it's 429 and 431 in golden quality if i remember correctly and also it's not only increasing your weapon and spell damage but it's also healing you for 258 health every 15 seconds and this effect healing effect is also scaling from your um, max magica or max stamina uh, depending on what your build is it's really awesome set if you are playing, if you are farming any arena, Vetishan arena, or Maelstrom arena, or Infinite Archive solo without um, Walking Soul Ring, you definitely need this set. It's one of the best uh, sets in the game for solo player. And another another really awesome activity in, the, in, in this DLC, it was one of the first arenas in the game, it was first solo arena in the game, is Maelstrom arena. And this arena is also giving you a bunch of really awesome rewards, really nice rewards, really useful rewards. And even even nowadays, um, maelstrom weapons like, for example, Inferno maelstrom stuff that was meta for that was meta for so long, it's still a very useful tool. For example, such builds like um, Magica, Fire, uh, Dragon Knight damage dealer, and other builds, even for regular uh, mana two panel damage dealers, it's still really decent set that you uh, also can use, and it will it will reward you with a really nice um, damage output. So Maelstrom and, and for PvP builds, it's a really powerful uh, two handed we two, two two handed weapons uh, Maelstrom two handed weapons that you also do not want to miss. So it's one of the best. It's best. It's the best DLC for new players. It's one of the best DLCs in general for veterans. In if you are talking story-wise, if you are talking reward-wise, and yeah, here it is. So there are two free mounts, uh, free DLC in March, uh, three free costumes, uh, free pets. Uh, free pets, 500 seals of endeavors, and in addition, 10 crown crates, Calcola crown crates. So you definitely do not want to miss this reward. So like and subscribe, subscribe guys, if you want more such videos, uh, such research, such urgent ESO news, and also if you're interested in guides and other stuff like I'm doing, like uh, action RPG and RPG guides and other game guides and builds. So see you in the next video. Good luck.